Hey guys, welcome back to Chicken Brilla. I am your host, The Chicken, and in today's video, guys, we talked about yesterday the absolute worst brawler in Brawl Stars, who we still have displayed on our screen here. Uh, we did go back in for that next match, and we almost got into 500, but for today we're focusing on the absolute best brawler in Brawl Stars. Now, if you guys don't have this brawler, and if, say, for example, you want to buy him with cash or whatever in the shop, I do appreciate it if you uh, throw that code check in, guys. It does help to support the channel, especially as a smaller YouTuber. Um, so thank you guys for anyone that does do that. And we're also very close to 30,000 subscribers. You guys, if you guys see the videos sometimes, you don't mind them. Maybe you love it. Maybe you, maybe it's just, you know, a good watch every now and then. I appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button to get us to that 30k. That would be a nice milestone to hit. So with that being said, guys, uh, let's go over the best brawler in Brawl Stars right now. And this is going to be based on win rate and percentage. Um... And just who's the absolutely most broken, and that is going to be, you guys have probably already guessed it, Mr. Kenji. He's just too good. He's too strong. And we got his first star power right here, actually. Study the blade. Slash Himi slices have 30% longer range. That's pretty good. After avoiding damage for 5 seconds, 90% damage reduction with the next enemy attack. Now, we definitely want offense with Kenji. So, yeah, that's going to be good. This is a pretty good build. Pretty good build. We are missing a couple coins to max him out, unfortunately. Ooh, 99. Would that give us enough? No, we need 2,800. We need 2,800, don't we? Damn. Um, all right, let's open this up. Cool. All right, so let's, uh, we picked, we, we're still on Mr. Roofs. Roofs just doesn't want to, he's mad, and he's mad that we made him the, we talked about him being the worst brawler in Brawl he, he wants us to use him again, so. Kenji. He's so good, and especially in solo showdown. He's just amazing. So much damage, really good amount of health. Super where he can jump up, become invisible, and kill anybody within his sights. Um, just, you know, he's got all the tools. He's got the best kit, you know, for solo showdown or for other game modes where you just have to simply kill brawlers. So, yeah, it's uh, kind of a no-brainer, I would say. I mean, there's a lot of really good brawlers. And especially when you start to get into like specific game modes and stuff, but the way I do these um, kind of videos is not about that. It's more about just like, you know, who are you going to be able to pick and just, you know, do well with kind of regardless. So that's how we did this one anyways. Whoa, who's the snake dude? That was crazy. Bro, get off of me, get off me, get off me, get off me. The problem with Kenji, though, it's kind of like how Edgar, uh, when Edgar came out, you guys remember that? Uh, people will just go for you, just because you're Kenji. And it's it's annoying, for sure. Alright, do you want to go now? Oh, okay. Everyone teams up with me, I guess so. I thought I, I was hitting my gadget, I thought I was going to heal. But, um, yeah, there it is. Really good stuff. Really good stuff. We only got ranked 4 there, 170 cups. We're doing better with roofs. Uh close to 500 but that doesn't matter that doesn't matter but I want to hear from you guys too do you agree or disagree do you think Kenji's the best overall in the game or do you think he's maybe not the best I think even if he's not the absolute best I think he's definitely up there um, just strictly in terms of you know picking someone kind of blindly and they're going to do well oh my god no damage taken recently you're not watching the game you not know, watching the game, Brawl Stars? Taking a lot of damage here. I just want this power cube. Leave me alone, Egg. Leave me alone. You're such a jerk. See, he can't do much once I get close to him. I just have to get close to him. Alright, at least we got the power cubes. I'll take this freebie, take a little bit of gas damage, I don't mind. Oh, we actually escaped there, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Alright. Okay, friggin' Hank again, man. I gotta hide here. People are just gunning for, uh, for poor old Kenji. I knew he was hiding there. Oh, it's Pearl. Pearl's my girl.
Ouch. Oh no! How did I not get my shot back up? Damn! Oh, Pearl's so good. Pearl's so good. <clears throat> I can do another video on the most underrated brawler in Brawl Stars, and I feel like Pearl would be right up there. If not the, uh, if not the one to beat. You guys can let me know if you agree or disagree on that in the comments, but... Um, I feel like a lot of people overlook Pearl, and I, I feel like she's really good. And, you know, again, in, in the way I do these lists, like kind of across the board, just generally, um, you know, really dominant in terms of damage, range, health. Um, really easy to use, too. Like, not a big learning curve or something, not like a different troop, kind of like Draco or something like that. Bro, these, these guys, they go for Kenji, man. So annoying. It's like they see Kenji, it's like, stop everything. No, I did not want you to go that way, bro. Ugh. <laughs> That's so frustrating. That was actually my fault. I wanted him to move forward towards the box. I thought he was going to auto attack that direction, but of course he did not. And then they both went for me at the same time. I feel like we did better at the roofs there than with Kenji. Kenji's also not max level. I have roofs at max level, so that's more helpful, I guess. But uh, we got some XP. I think we got a star draw. No, no star draw. Uh, we got some credits, so we'll take that. But yeah, like I said, I mean, it's subjective. All this stuff kind of is. Um, if we go in terms of most trophies, um, yeah. I mean, these were some of my best, bra best brawlers. Um, you see Roofs, funny enough, is uh, is up there. I just haven't used Kenji enough just yet. Clancy, I'd also say, is definitely maybe not the best in the game, but I'd put him, like, top 15 probably in there, so, like, very good for sure. Griff, I feel like, is underrated. Squeak can be underrated for sure. Um, I think that's what we'll do for our next video. We'll do the most underrated brawlers because I feel like there's a lot. There's just so many brawlers. Like, 84 brawlers is crazy. It's so many. And, like, a lot of these ones that I even have down here, like Miko, um, you know, Byron can be really good. Barry's amazing. Um, there's a lot of really good characters down here um, that I just straight up have not used yet. But Melody, Willow, uh, Angelo, Eve, Lily, I'd, I'd put those in some, some of the bottom of the list as well. But like I said, I want to hear from you guys, so thank you guys for watching this video. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. Who's the best and who's the worst? Who's everywhere in between? Who's an underrated one that people don't think of a lot? Because I want to do some research for the next video. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Appreciate you. Catch the next one. Check it out. Back, back.